Hi, this is Misako Sasa. I've been teaching Japanese home style cooking here in New York City for 15 years. Today, I'll be using some ingredients from Kochi Prefecture, Japan, and make easy recipe for anybody can try. Kochi Prefecture is on Shikoku Island facing the Pacific Ocean. It has rich forests covering 84% of land and the Shimanta River, known as Last Clean Stream. There are so many delicious and fresh ingredients from mountain, sea, and river, as well as local farms which create a variety of regional delicacies and dishes. I'd like to share some of these ingredients through this video. Today, I'll be introducing Battera Kombu. Kombu is a type of seaweed packed with umami. In Japan, we use it for making soup stock or base of the soup. Battera kombu, also called shiroita kombu, which means whiteboard kelp in English, is a very thin kombu often used when making mackerel sushi. It's as thin as one millimeter and requires highly skilled professionals to shave each piece by hand, since this cannot be achieved by any machinery. Izuri kombu was established in 1868 and has been proudly committed in making battera kombu which is domestic, no additives, and hand-shaped, as well as hiring and training its craftsmen. Today, I'll be making poke bowl with tuna and quinoa. So let's start. First, I have a bowl of already cubed sushi-grade tuna. To this, I'll be adding some seasoning. First, soy sauce. And some mirin. This adds a little bit of sweetness to the sauce. Sesame seeds, white sesame seeds if you have it. And some chopped scallion. And some sesame oil. And to this, I'll be adding some battera kombu, two or three pieces. And I'm, I'll be using some scissors to cut this in a very fine strip. So to do so, I'm going to first cut this in half. Roll this up. Battera kombu has a lot of umami and also has a very unique texture that complements tuna. Because it has some vinegar, uh, it also goes well with fish. So now I'm going to mix them very well. I'm going to let it sit for about 5 minutes. So I put a generous amount of tuna on quinoa. I'll be adding some vegetable. I have cucumber, radish, avocado, and then some tomatoes. As an option, you can put this chili pepper for extra kick. There, this is a poke bowl with tuna and quinoa with battera kombu. Please enjoy.